war doesn't get in the way of that. Okay, so what should we expect from your tour? Like, what kind of surprises do you have in store for your fans? It's going to be great. It's going to be a lot, a lot more, a lot better from from my standpoint as a performer um, than the last uh, Scream tour that we were on yeah. this IMX because I get to do more. You know, it's going to be more, more dancing, more impact. And it's, it's gonna be, it's just, it's coming for me. So you know, I get to, I'm gonna play the piano a little bit, get more personal with the audience and stuff like that. So it's gonna be a lot of fun. B2K show is off the chain, as as, as usual. So and, you know, Mario got some heat coming too. So and uh, we looking at Janae probably opening the tour. So a lot of y'all might be familiar with Janae. So I mean, um, it's gonna be hot. I, you can expect a great show. It's just gonna be, you know, intense. It's it's 110 percent. You know, so it's gonna be hot. Tell us about your album that's coming out. My album comes out April 15th, and um, it's you know it's it's a little more mature, you know, than uh, I wouldn't say too much more mature because we pretty much made the transition from young young boys to young men with the whole first time and beautiful with all those songs to IMX. So you know it's it's not too much different from IMX, but it's just more me, you know, more personal experience that I'm talking about. And it's more you know my album seen through my eyes and what I've been through as a as an artist and as a as an individual and as a young man growing up in the business and just just period growing up with the relationships and everything. So it's you getting it all. I gave my I gave my all. I put my foot in it for y'all, all the fans out there. So you know y'all can expect a great album. Okay, cool. Now we have um, a section on our site called On the Corner of 106. Okay. Now I'll answer a couple questions from that. All right. All right, so tell us, who do you think is one of the most misunderstood persons from like the last 10 years? Other artists have said people like Tupac, Biggie, Michael Jackson. So who I do think, you feel like I think Michael Jackson is very misunderstood. Um, you know, for one, I think R. Kelly is very misunderstood. You know, for one, like me, like I feel like, you know, the whole thing happened with R. Kelly, the whole... I mean, to me, I, I think R. Kelly's a genius. I actually got a chance to work with R. Kelly with this album. B2K also did. I think he's a genius at what he does. You know, I think everybody, no one's perfect. No one should be judged. Only God can judge you. And I don't think no one should be judged by another man because you wouldn't want anybody, you know, judging you off of what you did in the privacy of your own home. You know what I'm saying? R. Kelly puts out great music. As you can see, his album is platinum. His new album, after all this stuff. He does his thing, he puts out great music, something that the world can sing along to, and he, he entertains his audience, and that's all anybody should worry about. Michael Jackson does the same thing, he puts out great music, he's a great entertainer. And I think a lot of people, you know, should just kind of back off him a little bit as far as like with their personal life, like, you know what I'm saying? What everybody does in their, in their privacy is what everybody does, you know what I'm saying? Nobody should knock or judge anybody for that. And if you love the music and if you're a fan, then just keep buying the music and it's like, you, you, you do your thing. Okay. Now, um, what is like one thing about yourself or your looks or anything that you like want to change that you have the ability to? Ah, man. <laughs> I don't know. I I don't like I don't like these bags on my face. These like little, I got these little line creases in my face. And, you know, I don't like that. I'll probably change that if I could. But then again, you know. There's, you know, a lot of people would change a million things about themselves if they got the chance to, but, you know, God blessed me with the talent to entertain, and that's what I like to do, so I love to entertain. Okay. So now what is one thing that you know for sure? That I know for sure about what? Just period? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know, a lot of things for sure. I mean, that's, I don't know. I, I know that, um, I know that I love my fans for sure, and I know that um, I know that I'm I'm a great entertainer, and I, I like to entertain. And I know that uh, one day I'm a, I'm a pass on, and I just want to be remembered as a legend, like Michael Jackson, like R. Kelly, and like the le living legends before me. So, and I know for one thing that uh, I love the ladies. And ladies love me, so you know. <laughs> Now, what's one thing that you hate being asked by a journalist? Man. You know, everybody's been asking you about Beyonce. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm pretty sure you're fed up with that one. I mean, yeah, it's because it's like, you know, uh, everybody wants to know about me and Beyonce, and that's, that's my great friend, you know. I've been friends with Beyonce since we were 16, and that's we're, we're always going to be great friends, you know. 
And you know, like I tell everybody, everybody's like, I heard you dating Beyonce. And it's, it's like, oh man, you know, because it's like we 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 talked about it. And it's like I don't want to like even bring it up. You know what I'm saying? I, I I like to keep you know all I can say is we're great friends, and that's what that's what it is. So you know, I don't want to even get into it like that. But you know, that's my that's one of my best friends. I love Beyonce to death. So. Okay. Um, and the last question is, what is one of your favorite sayings or quotes? Something that you might use like for inspiration or something that your mom told you? Um, never give up. That's, that's, that's what I live by. Never give up on anything. Whether it's your career, whether it's in life, you know, personal goals, you know, business goals, anything. Just never give up.